Hi guys, welcome back again to my channel Cooking with Lisa. I have a really good recipe for you guys today. As you know, I'm in New York, so I'm trying to get as much Guyanese recipes like as I can for you guys. And the person to do this is my mother. So I have to thank her very much for making all these Guyanese snacks for me so I can share my culture with you guys. So today we're going to make something, another Guyanese snack named Sal Seo. But in Guyana, it is known as chicken foot. It does not look like a chicken foot at all. And I'm not sure why they call it that, but that's what it's called. And it is also eaten with spicy mango sauce, also known as um, mango sour. So the ingredients you'll need for this recipe are flour, some garlic, yellow food color. You will need ground dal, also known as split pea powder. And you will need some salt and a little bit of pepper. So we're going to make this recipe today in the mixer here, but you can also mix it by hand. So into the mixer, pour the flour in there, along with some garlic. And the split pea powder. You're going to add a little bit of salt to taste. And yellow food coloring. I will list the amount of ingredients we're using to make this recipe in the description box down below this video. And some hot pepper. Now we're adding water to form a dough. After you're finished mixing the dough, let it knead for about 5 minutes and then transfer it to your work surface. This is what it should look like. As you can see, we're dividing it into smaller balls so it will be easier to handle. After you're finished making smaller balls with the dough, take one and roll it out. You're going to roll out each one, dust it with some flour if it's too sticky, and you're going to roll it out thinly. Then place each one on a flat pan to cook for about 15 seconds on each side. Then set them aside and continue to do this for all the dough balls you have. So here we have the salsa sheets that are pre-cooked. Next, fold it in half like this. Then fold it back into quarters, cut it in half, and then cut like this. Into very fine strips. And this is what it looks like after you finish cutting them.
You will need a lot of vegetable oil to fry the salsayo. Here they are. When the oil is hot, put them in there, not too much. And allow them to fry until they're golden brown. And here you have it guys, the final product, salsayo, also known as chicken foot. It's really crispy and you eat it with spicy mango sauce or mango sour. So that's all for today's video guys. I hope you enjoy watching this video today. If you did, give it a like and I'll see you guys later. Bye!